Hey guys, it's Shalon with the Paradox Gaming Network. And tonight I want to talk about just a couple of really simple ways to keep a lot of your notes organized. Uh, I keep telling people about snipping tool or when I send somebody an image that I've had a couple of people ask me like, how did I get like half of a screenshot? No, I didn't take a screenshot and drop it into like paint or Photoshop. Uh, I just use snipping tool to grab what I want of uh, the display in my screen. And then as you've seen a lot of the videos that I do, I like to grab images like last night's stream. I had the Belgian news article on that. Well, I like to keep those images for streams or videos or for sharing with other people. Well, the problem is I started to develop this really, really big collection of clippings, snippings is what I call them. Uh, it's a it's, it's a snipping tool, it saves as an image, but you just end up with thousands of them. Well, I like to use Google Docs now. I like to use the Keep Notepad because it just adds a little bit more versatility to how I can use the image and coming back to it later. So what I wanna show you guys is on any given day, uh, I go to about six or seven major video game news sites always looking for something to talk about on my shows. Well, I don't have a chance to read absolutely everything right then and there. So I'm here at Massively right now, and as I'm going through, uh, I'm just looking for stuff I might want to think about or talk about, and I see, oh, MapleStory 2. I, I know a lot of people are excited about MapleStory 2. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to click in here. And the reason why I click in is because I want to make sure that I can grab this uh, I, so I can grab the URL if needed. So now as I scroll through, not a very long article, so I'm going to be able to get it all on the screen. What I'm going to do is I'm going to bring up Snipping Tool. I really love this program for a couple of reasons. Number one, it's going to let me take a picture of whatever I want of the screen from the smallest piece to the whole thing. I also can set it on a delay, which means if I want to use this to go into game to capture a tooltip on an item, I can absolutely do that as well. Just gotta make sure you set your delay. Usually three to four seconds is enough to, you know, tab back in. Anyway, I'm gonna hit new. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna freeze the screen. Whatever was on the screen at the time is gonna get frozen. So if there's ads that are, that are um, cycling through, if there's a video on the screen, if you wanna grab a capture out of a movie, this is one way to do it. Uh, so what I do personally is I always like to grab the URL and I'm going to come through and I'm going to grab enough that if I needed it later, I can work with the image. Now, before I drop it into Google Docs, there's a couple of things I can do. Say I wanted to highlight the battle royal mode of this. I love snipping tool because it lets me do the markup right in the tool itself. I don't have to drop it in paint or Photoshop. I want to make sure that the person... I send this image to understands that it's battle royal mode. So I can simply highlight battle royal mode, big circle around it, they're going to get it. Another thing is say this was a longer article and I wanted to highlight a particular piece or I wanted to remember something. Uh, and actually there's a highlighter up here and you can actually highlight over a, a portion. So if this was an important note or a quote or something I wanted to include in a term paper, you know, when you're going to start to have hundreds of these piled up for your research, you're not going to want to try to remember why you made each clipping. You simply highlight and there you go. Now, got a couple of choices here. Like I said, I can save this right now and it's going to create an image. The problem is, like I said, on any given day, I could generate as many as a hundred of these and then my desktop's clouded up or I have a folder full of stuff that I have to click on each image. Like, why did I want you or what I can do? And a ton of people don't even know this feature. I'm going to copy this. I'm going to come into Google Docs and I'm going to paste it. Now, over here on the side, you see this side menu notes from keep. It's actually notes from keep notepad. Now, when I drop this image in, and I only, I only dropped the one in because I wanted it clean and neat, but I'm going to just start having a whole pile of them. I can scroll down, I can look, and then later on this afternoon, I can be like, why did I clip this again? Oh yeah, Maple Story, Battle Royal, Mush King Championship. Let me clip this off to the person. Let me drop it, whatever I want to use it for. The problem is, you could do this in Word. You could do this in a lot of programs. 
but then you're still going to have to come here. You're going to have to copy the image and then you're going to have to drop it somewhere else. Now you're going to have to drop it in a paint and that's not a time saver. Here's the time saver. If I right click on it and I save it to the keep notepad, it's going to come over here in a list of things I want to keep. And then if I need to export it as a savable file, all I got to do is right click on it and save image as. Now, if I'm working in some programs, if I'm going to drag this into say Photoshop or I want to put it in Photoshop, I can do that. Um, if I want to share the image, I can do that. Um, I, I can search the internet for the image, which is useful if you're looking for certain things and then you're like, I forgot to get the URL. I forgot to cite it. You might get lucky and Google might find the image for you or get you close. Um, so with that guys that's it just a little life hack for how you can get a whole lot of notes put together and then using two very uh, underutilized tools using snipping tool and then once again using the keep notepad inside google docs and that's it guys hopefully this was useful to you if not no harm no foul you didn't lose anything for it have a good night hey where are you going you're not done yet see these videos this video is up here to watch. You got to go over here. Hit the chibi. Subscribe to the channel. Check out the webpage. And I'll see you guys on Twitch.